What's this? Just another weird Nordic structure. Could go that way, could also go this way. This looks like a path, in fact. I feel like I'm alone here. Thirsty. Seems to have run off. Oh! I killed some hunters. Twenty-nine twenty, volume one. <gasps> that's my favorite. Oh, wait, the cape belt. Uh, cape bear belt. That's my favorite book series in the game. I'd like to take that in case we get a chance to read it. See if we can get out of here before it comes back. Be up this way. Shit! Oh, Dargo went flying. <laughs> Dargo, are you okay? Now what? What are you fighting up there, Hood? Oh, no, another hunter. Good grief! Another goddamn saber cat. It fell down for some reason. Okay. Hello, ghostly wolf. So many freaking saber. Oh goddamn. Okay. Dargo. Are you up from the water yet? There you are. Here, you gotta take some stuff from your own book. Fine. Let's trade then. So much stuff. So much stuff. That's good. Malakath, witness our deeds. Okay, so wait, there was another hunter. Worker tusk is worth it. And there was another saber cat. Oof. Right. Now, let's finally try to climb this mountain. That slope, I'm going to say, is too steep. We can go up this way. What the hell? Ha! <laughs> I know that there's a road up there. I like to imagine that somebody was, like, carrying along a cart of books, and it ended up sliding down the hill, and they were like, Ah, fuck my books! Somebody's like, oh, do you want to go get him? They're like, nah, fuck it, just leave it down there. <laughs> Cross daggers, legendary sacratura, that's worth it. Kolb and the dragon. Roads of Skyrim. Holds of Skyrim. Horker attacks. Gentleman's Guide to Whiterun. Rising Threat, Olaf and the dragon. Dunmer of Skyrim. Okay, only one of them was worth anything, but let's keep going. That's funny. I'm looking around for ore. Maybe there's ore up here somewhere. Um. Hmm. Hello, bunny. We may have reached our. Uh. Uh. Nope, that's smart to go that way. What about over here? Uh, 
Oh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. This is progress. Come on. We can climb this mountain. Come on. I know that my, my group is... Oh, shit. My group isn't exactly following me, but... We're going to roleplay that they are. Um... Okay, this is good. We're making it. Whew. It's exhausting climbing this hillside. Okay, hang on, hang on. We can get up this, right? If I go up this way? Yes! Come on. Yes! Okay. We're getting there. There's still a long way to go, I feel like. Come on. Come on. Oh, shit, look! We did it! This is, uh, that's, um... You guys, we did it! Oh, they, they went the easy way. <laughs> this is a druidic... Dru, what is it called? Druidic readout? Broken tower readout. Druidic one readout. Druidic one. Ooh, we might get the drop on this time. Lousy shot. And they're gonna start shooting at us here pretty soon. Got him! Nice work, Hood. You think you stand a chance? I don't know if I'm hitting, I think Hood's the one that's hitting him. Oh! I got him. Yes! That's a kill! That I can't ever get the loot from, but without going inside the fort. Let's see if we can't. Uh, I should save it. I really just need to get past these people. Um. Yeah, I can get up there. Hang on. Ho 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 ho! Yes. I should be careful just in case one of those bastards comes running out. Nothing. Nothing worth taking. Isn't there somebody up here? Nobody? <sighs> is she hiding? What is she doing? No, she's shooting at Hood. She doesn't know that I'm here. Heal. Not on my watch. Is another one of you? Fuck it. This music is stirring. Oh shit. There's two of you. <laughs> uh, that's a bit more than I thought. Help. Help, gang, help. Ugh. 
Yes! Okay, let's get the loot and go. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's not waste any more time. We managed to do it, though. Okay, so let me make sure. Yep, we're on the right path. Karth Waston and Markarth. This way. Goddamn, the Reach has such dramatic terrain. Vigilant. Nah. Like I said, I'd rather not piss off the gods right now. I'm trying to get their blessings. Stendar and them. Carthlast. Okay. Geralt's sword. Whoops. What? I thought the game was going to crash there for a second. Geralt's sword from the uh, orc smith lady in Dushnik Yal. I'm guessing Geralt's one of the orcs we met mining when we were here previously. That have been Khajiit. Ah! Oh, wait. Geralt was the, the name of the smith. Lash is who we're supposed to give it to, I'm guessing. May your weapons be sharp and your prey fresh. Lash! Your mother, Geralt, wants you to have this sword. So that's it, then. Don't come back. Thank you. Here. You honored my mother's task and should be rewarded. Is that what that means? Now, I need to be alone. They give you a next time. They give you a sword and that means don't come back? Dargo, your, your people are kind of messed up, man. He's like, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I've never lived with any of them. That seems weird. Warrior cast, I suppose. You go out and make your fortune in the world. When your family gives you an, a weapon, that means you're on your own. Okay, let's see if we can't get to Mark Arth before sundown. Time to end. What? Yeah, you've been wounded worse. But it hasn't costed your life to this point. Yeah, an Alvin Mace, that's interesting. Okay, this sorry, Nico. This way to Markarth. So, Markarth, we're taking this journal because we want. Uh, Enthir told us we need to see Calselmo about getting it translated. Is this where that cave is? This is the cave. I bet the tower is part of the cave. Maybe that's something we'll check out someday. Use a drink. Wow. It looks massive over there. Answer is not in this guy? If it is, it's behind something. Clouds or terrain. The hell? Whoa! Ow, 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 you bastard! Thank <laughs> you. 
Damn it, I can't even see you and you're shooting with arrows, you prick. God damn. What the hell was this? Oh, he was fighting a robber. Wait, elven boots? Nah, that's not worth it. Damn, Forsworn. Uh, wait a minute. Did I use my last steel arrow? I did. I've only got silver. I'll take his iron then. What are you? What are you working on over there? I, I think I just saved it. I don't know. I'm doing it again. Okay, well look guys, we gotta go this way. Ah, Forsworn, Forsworn. So the robber took a couple out before she was killed. Which means that she would have this loot, presumably, or it would still be on them. Nothing there. Nothing there, alright, never mind. It's after sundown. We didn't get to mark our before day ended. <laughs> Hello. You, yeah, you just keep doing your own thing there, chicken. It's like, I got places to be. Hello. Speak quickly. Hand over your valuables. Don't hurt me. You win. That almost always means you have nothing to give me. In fact, you don't. All right, then. Those squat little trees. That's interesting. Oh! Is this the farm outside Markarth? I don't think we ever actually had it marked on our map, did we? Oh, and there's a Khajiit caravan! Okay, good. Let's, um, let's mark this on our map. Good grief! Rummer structures all over the place. Hi! My boy Leontius lives in Old Trolden. Damn drunk. Old Trolden, what's that? That's right. Old Inn to the south. The Oaf doesn't even bother to visit these days. What am I supposed to do if the dragons burn down the farm? Your farm's made of You're stone. A traveler, right? I have this letter for him. Let him know how much of a failure he <laughs> is. <laughs> You're a jerk, dude. Sorry, I don't have the time and I don't even know where that is. Typical. Well, don't mind me then. Alright, whatever, old man. Alright. Your husband's a jerk. Oh, what is this? A visitor to our farm? Oh, do stay for a while, dear. No way, man. Talk to your husband. He's kind of a prick. Okay, Khajiit Caravan. Yes? Is that what this is? Yes, it is. This one needs something? Nope, just seeing who of you is the traitor. Oh, hello. Yes. Dargo, fellow Quite orc. Well. Sides. Kayla, Lajan, Ataba, Risad. Do you seek to make a purchase? Yes, I do. Take a look. Maybe. I'd actually like to see what you'll buy from me. Ah, God damn, I keep forgetting to put that necklace on. Hmm. Hmm. Speech increase, that's nice. Uh, Ice and Chitin you can have. Mystery of Talara. Shadow Marks of Keeping. Spell Tome. Spell Tome. Legendary Sancrator. Three Thieves. And I guess I'll just start selling you jewelry, huh? Thanks for uh wait, actually what do you have for sale? 
<gasps> Speaking of able to pick locks of any difficulty almost by themselves. Oh my god. Okay, it costs a lot of money, but Dargo has a lot of money. Dargo, wow, you guys look like two of a kind. You have a grim look. I need all your gold, dude. This is how we're gonna get into the treasure. Treasury. Whatever's it called? What's it called? Treasure house? No. I don't remember what it's called. Damn it. Give me all that stuff. Also, give me stuff that I can sell him because I'll get some of this gold back. Um, give me that ring back, you dope. You're supposed to be wearing other stuff. Ring of recuperation, that's what you're supposed to be wearing. Taking that too. Okay. All right. All right. All right. To our Here's the plan. Oh god, I'm, I'm overburdened. Here's the plan. I'm gonna buy. Can I buy all of them? I'll certainly buy that one. Yes, I can. Oh, that's so much money. Okay, now. I can sell you a bunch of other stuff, right? Maybe make some of that back. And all the jewels. I've got tons of jewels! Gems. Keep that grand sold him. Sell you that. Another speech increase. Whoa, we leveled up! Nice! I guess that's it. Okay, so we ended up spending like nine grand. We made 4,500 of it back. We made half of it back. That's not bad. And of course I could sell them these soul gems and stuff, but I'm not going to because I've got the soul gem scrolls that should refill it. Sweet! And we can get into the treasury house. Treasury house, that's what it's called. Land of Alright, let's level up. With the health that we get from the ring, I'm gonna go with stamina. Smithing, I can't get anything else right now, right? No. Block, I can't get anything else. Two-handed, I'm not interested. One-handed. Ah, I can get Weapon Mastery 2. Marksmanship, nothing else is available. Nothing else is available right now. Evasion, I could get Finesse. Sneak, I've already got two of two. Lock picking, nothing new there. Pickpocket, two of two. Or Speechcraft, that one. I'd say it's between uh, Finesse and Evasion, or Weapon Mastery 2, which I think makes more sense. You regret making and let's see. Okay, let's save it again. Just because we did just level up. To Markarth. I do not. I have always dreamed of seeing new lands. Ah, oh, there's Masser. Damn. How oh, I missed it before. So we actually have. Yes. Thank you. Except when you're inside, people try to murder you. Uh, we actually have two reasons, then, to stick around in Markarth. One is to see Kyle Samo. The other is to try to steal that painting from the treasury house. We'll try to do both of them while we're here. But, it is already 8.15, I think. We won't talk to Kyle Samo tonight, because I bet he's probably already done for the evening. We Let's try to go by the treasury house, though, and just see... If this wouldn't be a better time than during the day. We 
we've got a potion of invisibility too. That guy's having a good time. Look at him. Everybody else is probably already closed up. Oh, maybe not. Excuse me. No. Do you know anything? I don't. Thank you for your time. Hello. Excuse me. Um. Shit. No, that's the keep. Yeah. Is this treasury? No. Damn. I already got lost. This is treasury. Nope. This is treasury. Yes. You lost. You guys open? The treasury house is really just for patrons of the Silverblood family. You don't belong here. I have records I need to tend to. Mm hmm. Hmm. It's relatively thinly populated at the moment. Oh, damn, that's locked again. Uh, so I need to be really quick. Unless somebody had a key on them that I could pickpocket. Key to Eltris's room. Yeah, it's probably not going to do it, is it? Hmm. Key was not enough. Hello, just checking the place out. I was curious uh, what you Silverbloods do around here. I'm right behind you. I work for the Silverbloods. Oh, Jesus. Clean. Who would have a key then if not you? Lady behind the counter. Hello. Brilliant. Uh, yes, thank you. I'm married to Thonar Silverblood. Keep that in mind while you're speaking to me. Okay, I'm gonna try this. Ooh, here we go. Yeah, <laughs> nice peaceful lock picking music. Okay, that's the one I want, right? Locks of any difficulty. What did I just do? I dropped it. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Talk about incompetent. Huh. Mm, spotted. Hello. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Come on, quit looking at me. Quit looking at me. thief of all time. <laughs> Is this going to overburden me? It might. If I just take it all. Uh-oh. Hey, wait a minute. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. So, you've come to hear the end of my story. What? You what? something I to tell because the questions will always be more interesting than the answers and the best ending the perfect ending will always be the absence of one I'm sorry I know where you're about to there's no end. Okay, okay, okay. I'm, I'm trying to remember. So there was a there was a 
a high elf in solitude who was staying with the two high elf ladies who run their own shop. And he was like, oh, you must find me the last painting of Esther Moreau. Her paintings tell a story and blah, 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 blah. And I was like, yeah, okay, we'll do whatever. Then I talked to his assistant here in Markarth, and she was like, oh, if you look upon the painting, it means death. Uh, and I was like, oh, I'll steal it. So, uh, ending. This must be referring to the story that the, the other the high elf dude was telling us about. Unfortunately, no. I once sought the perfect ending to my story, only to find the words eluded me. So I tried to frame it not with words, but pictures. But even then, I failed. Interesting. That is, until the day I met a wanderer, who kept a dog as his companion. Uh-oh. He offered me a proposition. Okay, Silico might not know this, but uh, Pem knows that she's referring to Clavicus Vile. What sort of proposition? He would grant me what I desired most, but asked nothing in return. He took pleasure in knowing that perfection would provide its own disappointment. Because to maintain its secret, the painting required a protector. And so here I am, guardian of my own shame. I'm thinking too much. What are the corpses on the floor? Okay, what is the painting? The wanderer I spoke of was none other than Clavicus Vile. Aha! I asked him for the perfect ending, and this is his answer. The painting itself is proof that such an ending exists, and the death of its owners ensures it will never be known. I see. Okay, so he, so you're able to write an ending, but the ending kills anybody who looks at it. Tragic. Um, who are these corpses on the floor? These must be people who have sought out the ending. Huh? They, like you, are curious souls who sought the ending to my story. And when given the chance, they have all chosen to keep it. Hmm. Why do you think you had so much trouble with it? It is the paradox of any mystery. The answers will never satisfy your curiosity. They are only varying levels of disappointment. That's an excuse without any based on actual Dormer theories. I don't remember what story it was she was trying to tell. Why not end on a cliffhanger? True, there's no really satisfying way to finish a story about the dwarves. I don't. Uh, Stilico doesn't know enough about the dwarves to be able to say. Why not end on a cliffhanger, though? Why? Why not leave him always wanting more? <laughs> Maybe Silico has some showman in him. Because then my motives would be transparent. And delaying the end is just as damaging to the narrative as a poor one. Hmm. So what happens now? You have a choice. You may choose to adhere to my wishes and die by my hand. Hmm? Or you may take the painting behind you to serve as the new ending. Die by your hand. Okay, so... I think what she's saying is that the true ending of the painting, the one that I just stole, kills people who look at it. So I have an option of looking at the painting myself and dying. I think that's what she's saying. Or maybe that second question, what happens if I think she means I'm actually a fighter, I don't know. But I think the other option she's saying is take a different painting and pretend, tell everybody else that it's the ending so that people stop looking for the true ending. Okay, what's the painting depict? It's drivel. The worst kind of ending imagine. It will ensure that no others follow this path at the cost of my personal legacy. Why would you damage your own legacy? Simple. By giving you a choice, I allow 
allow you to affirm or deny the ending I chose. If you choose the cliché then, as a writer, I have already failed. Hmm, and what happens if I vanquish you? Which, let's, let's just admit, that's what I would do. <laughs> I... I haven't the faintest idea. None have succeeded so far. On the other hand, none of your predecessors have ever fought she back. A pretty big elven sword on her waist there. Okay, I'm ready to decide. Very well. Take the painting or take up arms. But I warn you, I will not go down easily. I think uh, Stilico is like, uh, this lady made a deal with Clavicus Vile. She's stuck here in a room with no goddamn doors. Well, one door, but you can't get out of it. I don't know that he wants to mess with her. She's got maybe she's got Clavicus Vile's protection. I think I might just take the painting. different gear on that would kind of look like uh, Nebish. Hey, she duplicated some of her paintings. It's all very good. I would be really curious to know what happens if I attack her, but I don't think I'm going to do that. Can I talk to her one more time? Oh my god, she's blind. There's nothing else to say. Let's take the painting and go, then. What does it say this cell is called? Moreau's painting. Oh, I'm inside the painting! Am I inside the painting? <gasps> it all happened in an instant! And I'm... I'm tired now, so I'm overburdened. Is that what's happening? 232 out of 200. Darko, come here, dude. My blood's calm. Fine. I just Let's got so much in. stuff out of that safe, dude. We're set for life. Maybe not for life, but pretty damn close. I gotta put the charm necklace on. Damn it. He's gonna put the gold diamond ring on. I know he is. He's a numbskull. Should be enough for us to get out of here. Malakath, witness our death. <laughs> so long, everybody. Suckers. You just let go. Of them. Right out from under their noses. I got teleported to a completely different dimension, and they didn't even notice. All right, let's go get some sleep. Tomorrow we'll do the uh, Kalsamo talk. In 
A room at the inn. Come Sweet. on in. The Silverblood Inn has plenty of strong drink and clean rooms. We leveled up. We got some pretty sweet scrolls, and I am pretty sure we picked up like almost ten grand in loot out of that safe. That was fantastic. This is the Silver Blood Inn. I'll let you figure out who owns it by yourself. Yeah, I think I just robbed him blind. <laughs> I like to rent a room, dude. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Thanks. I think I actually hit the wrong option. I think I wanted to hit. Well, I don't know what I wanted to hit. It's not there anymore. I'll show you to your room. That's all right. This way. Just leave it. I'm gonna eat some dinner. All right. This calls for a celebration. Venison steak, some cheese, uh, that honey nut treat, and the hunting brew mead. Oh yeah. Just pulled off the heist of a lifetime, and I don't think they are even gonna suspect. Maybe, uh, maybe they'll. You want a drink? No, I'm good. Too lazy to give him a drink yourself. Oh. She's talking to me or him? Must be talking to him. I suppose they could open their safe, but I'm gonna say they don't have any reason to suspect anything was taken. I just came in, looked around, and as far as they know, I walked right back out. In fact, let's role play it and say that Esther Moreau's painting teleported us back to uh, to the treasury house the instant before we actually uh, tried to open the safe. So they didn't even see me try to open anything. That's what I'm gonna say. Makes sense then that uh, Stilico would not be in the least worried about being found out. He can stay in town and go talk to Kalsamo tomorrow without any fear of uh, repercussions, I'm gonna say. All right, everybody. We're going to sleep for, uh, let's make it seven hours. Thanks very much for watching. Until next time, take care, and I will see you around.